Hey, Austin, tell our, our friends what we're gonna make today. A folding snake. Yeah, we're gonna fold a snake. It's really cool. It's gonna be an accordion snake. Yeah. So it can get really small and then get really big. Mm -hmm. You excited? Mm -hmm. Now for this lesson, you need construction paper. We're using two different colors. You're gonna use green and yellow. I'm gonna use blue and orange to make mine. We also need scissors and tape. We're also gonna use our marker and some glue at the end. Now the first thing we need to do is use the scissors to cut strips out of our paper. And we're gonna cut them about an inch wide. Now if you want, you can stack the paper together and then cut it like this. This part we're gonna fast forward, but you guys can pause the video to cut your paper also. Now we cut four strips. Now you could cut more if you want to make your snake longer. We're gonna put our scissors off to the side. The next thing we need to do is take all of the strips that are the same color and we're going to tape them together. So we're gonna take these two like this, get a little piece of tape right here. And we're just gonna put a little piece of tape to connect these two together. And we're gonna do that with each color. So we're gonna make a really long strip of orange and a really long strip of blue. And you're gonna do the same thing with your green and your yellow. <laughs> okay, these are really long strips and we have one for each color. So the, the yellow is not connected to the green but they're really long. And I've got my blue and my orange right here also. Now we're gonna tape these two strips together and let's start with just your snake. So we're gonna put the green one out in front of us like that, okay? And then right here, we're gonna put the yellow one on top. Now we need another piece of tape and we're gonna tape it like this. Now look at this, we're making an L shape, okay? We have one strip going in front of us and one going out to the right. So here's another piece of tape, and we're gonna tape it together. Right. Yeah, that's a good spot. Good. Okay, now let's do one more piece of tape, and we're gonna fold it. Watch this, we're gonna tape it on the bottom like this, and then fold it around the bottom so that they'll stay together. Okay, <laughs> now we're ready to start folding. So the first step is we're gonna fold the green one down. Watch this. We're going to fold it straight down like that. Okay. Do you want to crease it right there? Good job. Now we're going to take the yellow one and we're going to fold it over to the left. And we want to make sure that it's right on the paper like that. Fold it down. Oh, <laughs> you did it. Now we're going to do that same thing. We're going to repeat that same step and we're just going to alternate between each color. So each each color is gonna fold on top of the other one. So the green one went forward. Now the yellow one's gonna go off to the right. Like that. You wanna press it down, squish it. Do you think you could do the rest all by yourself? Yeah. Okay, it's pretty simple. This part we're gonna fast forward and you guys at home can pause the video to fold your snake also. And I'm going to set up my orange and blue one and I'm gonna fold it with you. you ready to fast forward? Yeah. and see if we can get one more. You know what, we could just cut those, these last little pieces off. Let's use the scissors, and if we want, we could fold those, but let's just cut them, and then we'll cut this one too, right here. Cut this little extra piece off, and then at the very end, we're gonna use another piece of tape to stick these together, right here. So you just stick it right there, and then wrap it around, and then fold it over. I'm gonna do the same thing on the end of mine. Get a little piece of tape, put it on there Whoa. and then fold it around the edge and around the back. And there we go. Awesome, look at that, man. Isn't that cool with two different colors? Yeah. So it looks like an accordion. It can get really small and squish up and then get far apart like this and really long. Yeah. Now the last thing we need to do is create a head for our snake. Now Austin, we're gonna use the scratch paper that we had left over to draw a shape for our head on the snake. We're gonna draw a big oval that's really big for his head. There you go, oh, that's a good shape. Now let's draw some eyes. I'm gonna draw two ovals. This is gonna look like an alien. <laughs> and then I'm gonna draw smaller circles inside for the highlight and then color in that big circle. Then I'm gonna give him two nostrils down here at the bottom. 
and then let's cut that shape out. Let's also use the, the same color we're going to use to draw the tail. Now I'm going to draw a big shape like this. It kind of looks like an upside down U. Yeah. And you can turn your paper sideways if you want. There you go. So you can fit it in. Yeah. There you go. And if we want, we could turn it into a rattlesnake. So I'm going to draw a couple lines going across. And then down at the bottom, let's draw a line to connect the U at the bottom. Now let's do one more thing. We're going to switch to our other color and we're going to draw a tongue for the for our snake head. So we're going to draw a big long W, the letter W. There you go. And then up at the top, connect it. Now we're going to cut these two shapes out. We're going to cut the tongue out and also the tail. Now the very last step that we need to do is take our glue sticks and we need to glue the tongue to our snake head. So I'm going to just put a little glue on the end of the tongue. So there's yours right there. And then we're going to stick it to his head. <laughs> I'm also going to glue the end of my, the accordion or his snake body. Oh, here's your head. I'll help you. We're going to glue it right here. And then it looks like the tongue is sticking out of his head. Yeah. <laughs> is that cool? <laughs> okay, now let's take our accordion or the body and squish it together like this. And then we're going to glue. <laughs> it's a little tricky, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <We're> gonna... <laughs> it's a little slippery. Yeah. <laughs> I'll help you. Here we go. You use the glue stick and we're going to glue the end. So just put it all over. There you go. Put lots of it. Put even more. There we go. Now we're going to put his head on that part. Then we're going to flip it over like this. Let's glue this side too. There we go. Good job, buddy. And then let's take his tail and we're going to glue that right to the end of his body. <laughs> and then look at that. You got a snake. Now I'm going to do the same thing to my body. I'm going to glue the head on and also the tail. All right, Austin, we did it. We finished our snakes. Look at this. Look, you can put, stack them like this. And then look, boom, they jump. <laughs> kind of jump out of your hand. They are so cool with two colors. Now, one other thing that we could have done is we could have made even longer snakes. We could have taped together more strips, and that would make our snake even longer. We hope you had a lot of fun holding your snakes. Yeah, we do. We hope you had a lot of fun. And we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye. Let's make them dance. Oh, snake battle. Bam. Bam. Snake battle. Oh.